People often ask when running a small tree farm, what do you do when it's windy? Like today, it's really cold, it's windy, it's pretty crappy outside. We still have some trees left and most of them are blown over. What do we do to keep them standing up throughout the winter and things like that? If you wanna know how we do that, stay tuned. It's true, when you got a bunch of trees at your house in pots, anytime the wind blows, they blow over. That's kind of the number one thing that we've learned over the last six or seven years, is you're constantly setting up, picking up trees. Now it rained all night long and the trees that laid over on their sides probably didn't get a lot of water, which is a bit unfortunate. So today I'm gonna go out and try to get them all stood up in more of a permanent style. And that way maybe they won't fall over for the rest of the winter. So yeah, I'm down here now where we typically sell trees. Again, I'm basically sold out. I've got a couple, oh crap, fancy crap, flowering crab apples. But like, these are laying on the ground. How come these aren't laying on the ground? I'll show you what I did before, and then you'll see what we're gonna do more of. The big difference here is some of these pots that are still standing, I just took a piece of rebar and drove it down through the bottom of the pot into the ground. And so far, that's working pretty well. So I want to do more of that today, so I have to do less of what I'm doing right now. Even though it's cold and shitty outside right now, this is probably the best time to do this. Again, it's just a piece of like quarter inch rebar. Put this where I think they'll hold the rest up. Some of these big arbor varieties over here. A little red oak. Ain't never hurt nobody. Now I do got some white pines here left. Some of these are in better shape than the other ones. This old dog could probably go to the burn pile, but let's rebar these up. Maybe together they'll pull over left. Move them over here by the others.
video today. It's too rainy and crappy and cold and windy, but hey, I still got stuff I gotta do. We're gonna be ordering more trees probably around February. If you remember, this entire area was filled up with a couple hundred. With all of our customers, we're basically sold out. This is what we got left. They'll be on clearance in the spring for sure. Um, if you like crazy videos being in the cold like this, give us a thumbs up. If this video made you shiver at home, be like, man, it's cold outside. Give me a double thumbs up. Otherwise, consider subscribing and we will hopefully catch you next time. We've got to get out. We've got to get inside. Hey, the good news is this fence is working perfectly so far. There's no deer, there's signs of deer all around this, but there's no deer inside, so that's good.